Hey guys, welcome back. Jim here once again, and now we're going to take a look at a beautiful Swiss-made Jacques Lemon Genève Collection chronograph. Well, here we go. Let's take a nice close look at it. The first thing I think that really jumps out at you is going to be that cubic style dial pattern that's been carved in there. I think it looks really classy and it brings an extra bit of uh, dimension to this overall look. Uh, you have a rather muted engraving that's been done on this uh, bezel. It's not been filled in with like black enamel or white enamel to make it jump out. So it's a little bit more of an upscale look. And what the markings are, that's going to be your tachymeter scale. Now, when you're using your chronograph, if you want to find out how fast a particular object is going across a one mile marked field, all you do is you just simply start your chronograph as, let's say it's a car, that car starts its trek. And then when you stop it, all you do is you look where the hand is pointing to that number, and that's going to be how many miles per hour that object, car or whatever, has been traveling. So it's a little bit more subdued on this particular version in the all gold tone. Going into the bracelet, you see it is a solid end link bracelet, so there's a really solid union between the bracelet and the case, and a pretty much seamless union as well. All brushed finish, so even when you do something like the gold tone variation, it's still not blingy and flashy. It still has a more subdued look to it. One of my favorite features, and it's a small little thing, but when you look at the supported style scissor clasp on the diver's flip lock safety clasp, the flip lock actually is contoured and has the Jacques Lemon logo built right into it. So I think it's kind of neat how they didn't just take you know, parts out of a parts bin and throw a watch together. Everything on this watch was custom made. And here you get a chance to see that size on the wrist. Now, like I said, it is going to be a smaller watch and it's going to play smaller. I think it's going to be good for a uh, man or for a woman. Being Swiss made with the sapphire crystal and all the quality components we've talked about, you know you're getting a rock solid watch at a rock solid deal. Well, now you've had a chance to see it on the wrist. As you see, it's not an overly large size, so I think a lot of guys are going to really enjoy this watch, as well as a lot of ladies. I think it's a great unisex size. If you want to take a look at the other options that are available to you, head on over to worldofwatches.com and check them out.